Raise your hand if you have a Nintendo Switch and have been affected by Joy-Con drift. That's what I thought. Just about everybody has. I think I'm one of the rare people who hasn't with my launch day system. But for those of you who are sick and tired of Joy-Con drift, it looks like Nintendo is finally addressing it with the rumored Nintendo Switch 2 or whatever they're going to call it. They're coming out with a new controller according to the United States Patent Office that includes a magnet fluid whose viscosity changes with a magnetic field intensity and becomes resistant when the operation element is displaced. So it's one of those things where it's not quite a Hall effect sensor, but it kind of has properties of that. I'm glad to see that they're finally coming out with a new sort of design which should finally address Joy-Con drift once and for all. Have you experienced Joy-Con drift? How many times have you had to replace your Joy-Cons? Or have you had it affect other controllers? Let me know down in the comments because 